Hey guys, so I'm having a litany of technical issues, be it this camera, several microphones, whatever the hell. I'm trying to play Aliens from 1990 on the arcade, yeah. Super Nintendo Classic, whatever the hell, I forgot my lines. Let's begin. This is a Konami game, please forgive the overscan. If this camera cuts out again, i am it's just going to be straight game footage from here out. I, I'm, I'm just so sick of this, okay? So, uh, yeah, this is more of a beat-em-up than a shooter, though you are shooting the whole time, there's no melee. Player number one is Ellen Ripley from the movie Aliens, of course, and I believe if you have a player number two, that would be Dwayne Hicks, the other surviving adult human. I have gone through this about ten times, and I'm just a little peeved. Okay, so unlike Alien vs. Predator, look at how Newt's actually there. Like, it seems like there's some stakes. Hey, we're supposed to be rescuing Newt. Why is she running away from me? I can't tell you. I've got two bombs in the corner. I'm not really sure how to use them. Not that I even need them because I also have a goddamn rocket launcher. Like another Konami title, Contra, the... What do you want to call that? Aspect changes? A little bit of change of gameplay here. You guys remember this alien from the movie, right? The giant purple one that turns pink and... Look at this embarrassing shit over here. I had to go and die. Yeah, I lost my power up. That means it's gonna take longer. Oh, what do you know? A beheaded alien survives. This thing is so damn hard to kill. Can I shoot that blast coming at me? No, not really. Got a juke. Hopefully that's pretty simple. And there we go, highly explosive alien, and uh, well you guys arrived just in time to miss the party. Uh, yeah, we're changing things up a little bit here, driving sequence, you know, straight from the movie, right? Remember when Ellen Ripley here got on top of the APC and, uh, you know, started shooting aliens by herself. While, uh, I don't know who the hell is driving, Burke? Yeah, there's really not a lot to this, guys. You just hit select to put another quarter in, so I guess this affords me a good opportunity to talk about the Alien films, as really none of them are showing up on any streaming platform. Now there's a green thing that took off with the chick. Yeah, you remember that from the movie, right? There's a lot of things they saw in the film that they kind of included. This, actually, the crawling through... I guess Bishop did a little bit of this. But it's more of an alien thing. Toy line from Kenner in like, what, 92? They tried, to, it was weird. Like, Alien 3 was out, but they were trying to like revive the aliens. Apone, Hicks, Drake, all, the, all these like action figures. And a whole lot of different kind of aliens. And at the time it was like, oh, well all the, all the xenomorphs look alike. But then the toy line kind of opened up this idea that Whatever they, the host was, that's where they get some of their, their DNA properties. Um, oh, hey, I can backtrack a little bit. This guy's throwing this uh, grenades at me. I, I think those are androids turned bad. More of a hallmark of Alien from 79, not Aliens, the sequel from 86. And why I say that, I'll show you in a bit. Changing gameplay up here ever so slightly. We're descending an elevator, you know, because there was one scene in an elevator where Hicks got some acid on him. Get a little chance here to shoot up. Kind of losing our, our dimension here. We're really only walking side to side. Yeah, once you lose your power up, that's when the game decides to suck your quarters dry. All right, we gotta get these guys off. This is not, yeah, of course. There we go. Shit. I don't know what makes me more angry, like totally getting owned in this game, or uh, the fact that I've had to do this like 10 times. All right, so there we are. More of these like, not behaving like human type dudes, right? Ah, shit, we can't run, and we can't hide. But I got rockets. Of course, it'd be fun to play with two people. Shit, if I get a girlfriend, it's only gonna be to have someone to play games with. That will be... 
pretty much the only reason. I'll be like, hey, look, I can't afford for us to go on a date, but I have a Super Nintendo Classic I packed, and like every game you can possibly want to play. Will that be enough for you? Let's get out of here. Marines, we are leaving. You know what? Maybe Hicks has a shotgun. I, I don't know. Maybe there's a few different guns if you have second player up here. You remember that scene in the movie where the armadillo alien attacked you? And, um, yeah. Through dandelions. This takes longer than it should. Oh, what do you know, another explosive alien. I do want to show you what's coming up here, though. Like I said, like these, these guys are not behaving like humans that are harboring aliens. But these guys down here, these torsos, we know humans can't survive that shit. That's why I feel like they're androids, because it's like little things got misinterpreted from the film by the Japanese. Like the scene where where our bishop is put is like hacked in two basically. Yeah. Then that becomes oh hey, why don't we just have a lot of androids crawling around? Shit, shit, shit. Spider aliens, I guess. Uh, Xeno. Arachnids. Super bomb. I'm not. Oh shit! I didn't want to take the bait. What I do? Just walk over it. And... God, this looks bad. This does not look good. Okay. Oh boy, power loader. All right, so we got uh, high five and uh, jab. Let's do it. Oh yeah, remember that wrecking ball? Remember the uh, Hercules beetle alien? And of course. Do I, is it just holding me till I kill these things? Oh, go, 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 go. I think eventually it just kind of kicks you out. Oh, crap. Oh, Jesus. Can we get back in? Yes. Come on, Ripley. Yeah, there's enough little fun things from the movie to make you feel like, yeah, you're definitely playing a game where it, it's not just aliens, and it's by people who saw something in the movie. They saw the movie once, and they vaguely remembered a few things and included it again. Now those are definitely humans up there, see? And uh, we understand that on LV, whatever the number, is it 427 or something? They don't have a lot of different clothes, and everybody's a twin. Shit, shit, shit. Give me a break, please. You know, if I could get a power up, I could actually get through this quicker. Kill the eggs. Yeah, the, the game's fairly bespoke to the aliens. Um, Xenomorph Orgy, I guess? Oh no, scaling. Oh, this is gonna suck. Yeah, that felt great. All right, please just die. Okay, more credits. And you're changing color to let me know that I'm hurting you. You gotta shoot the head, right? Uh-oh, big diarrhea. And eventually you come across the queen. Um, you're gonna have to... Uh, you, can, you could theoretically deal with a lot of the other shit, or you could just kind of hit her in the, the good old egg sack. And just kind of plow away at that, right? You know the queen sprite looks nice and big. That would have been quite impressive in like 1990, but I mean, compare that to the, the ADP one, you know, just three years later. It's amazing how fast tech was moving, you know, in games. Everybody, everybody really brought their A game, for lack of a better expression. I wanted to one-up somebody. Now, they, now it's like, what can we keep making each year? Madden football. 
little changes as possible, update the roster, sell it for $60, and then con people into paying $100, then give them some kind of microtransaction. That's, that's the way things go now. Please die, please die, please die. Shit. Not me. Okay, we're just gonna walk up here and do this. We're do we do it live. Shit. Okay. Okay, so we've apparently taken out the queen, right? Just like in the movie. Oh, I miss... I miss running. Shit. Yeah, these boots that uh, Ripley has, these like, alien stompers. Uh, Reebok re reissued those. It was kind of a cool little thing the other year. Super, super rare. I mean, I got those Terminator shoes, but these are ridiculously tough to come by. It's like very limited edition. Oh, energy. You know, like that's that's old game logic right there. It's really Halo that changed everything for the game. Oh, hey, just quit getting shot for a cool minute and you get your health back or, in, or shield or whatever. And of course, uh, Call of Duty does the same shit. Before that, you walked around, you kicked over a dumpster, and you looked for turkey underneath. Because who wouldn't find pristine turkey under a dumpster, right? Um, as the Alien series goes, obviously the first two are the best. I do prefer the original slightly. I actually think that Alien 3 is actually a pretty good movie on its own right. Its problem is that it's not a good sequel. Because look at where this movie takes you. Sure, you don't really know a whole lot about Hicks, but you care about him. Newt, you know plenty about. Well, especially in the, the director's cut, right? Where it shows them before they get down to the planet. Well, uh, yeah, I mean, by them, I mean the Colonial Marines. So it's, it's like pre-crisis. And there's this conversation these guys have where it's like, Hey, why did we do something? You know what? I asked them the same thing. You know what they told me? Don't ask. Yeah, well, that was repurposed because it was cut. That was actually repurposed in Terminator 2 Judgment Day. Another James Cameron movie. But this movie, you build like this family unit, even with the bishop included in some way. And then they just throw that out the window with Alien 3 immediately. And, it, and it's a shame. Oh, hey, Bishop, thanks for uh, circling the platform. You know, I had to do some more fighting over here. Completely cut into the chase here. We're just duking it out with the queen. No little cutscene, nothing. Okay, so what we're doing here is we just... I, I really like the way her tail looks here. It's pretty beast. I think you, you just kind of lay enough damage into her, and eventually the the door opens up and you have to kind of push her out, which is really cool. I mean, the, the same thing the Japanese paid attention to that part of the movie. Come on, let's do this. Get over here. God damn, she takes you out quick. This is where the game wants its quarters. Now, yeah, it, this isn't really finesse work here. This is just brawler sort of coin op, you know? But hey, you're having fun. It's like aliens, right? completely awful, but you know, if I was putting quarters in at this point, I would be pissed. Can I get over here? Okay. New Bishop, somebody hit the damn button over here, please. I've done this a few times now, and she died a lot quicker before. Oh, Jesus. Can I just shoot her, or do I have to get in the, in the power loader? You know, there's not very many action films, and I would consider the first Alien a more horror, sci-fi horror. This is sci-fi action. Not many action films have really got their due from critics and, say, the Academy and stuff. This was really one of the first to really do it. Oh, the music's kicking. It's a little bit like it. A little bit James Horner. Oh, shit. Is it James Horner? The music... We gotta get you in here, come on. I'm gonna sneak around. Oh, we, there ain't no other way, we're doing this. Come on. Shoot. Alright, I don't know which shoot it wants me to. Oh, oh I got her. Did she fall? Yeah. 
And this is very much like the movie right here. It really is. Honestly, you never actually see the queen die. It just gives them outer space. Mission completed. Oh, you don't say. Okay. The aliens and caps bring. You gotta shout that. You have also survived. I didn't know I survived. Oh, thanks. Thanks for pointing that out. And there's the staff. Aliens, 1990. Yeah, you're going to be playing this for free. You can't really buy it. Are you getting your money's worth? Yeah, I mean, heck yeah. You know, this is a fun little game. You plop down with a friend or a little kid and you want to teach them about aliens. And yeah, we never really saw her go to sleep. You never saw her pick up Newt again. Did we ever see her rescue Newt? I'm not really totally sure, but um, it's a decent game. Um, I'll give Aliens, Konami, 1990, an 8.0 out of 10.